Hello everybody, this is Jody Ann Johnson with the 81st episode of Coffee with Jody. And today we're gonna to be wrapping up Earth Month and going green and lean. Over the last couple of weeks, we've been sharing with you some of the ideas that we've implemented here in our office, whether it's reducing our carbon footprint through uh, donations to B1G1 and their program, to drinking uh, water out of our big water uh, containers so that we're reusing those over and over, making sure we're getting enough water, to cleaning up the environment around us, going lean in the office through our cleaning up our processes, but also in our communication, and then even finding hacks that we can use in the office and at home, such as the rack that dries the, the plastic Ziploc bags so that they can be reused. I hope that we've been able to provide a few ideas for you um, throughout the blogs and the videos that we've been sharing. And I think probably the most important thing is obviously this is a movement, not just here, but around the world. A lot of times people get into the habit of doing things the way they always did. And I believe if we can just take small steps and incremental small steps to making shifts to a greener and leaner way of living that will move that way um, and build momentum as opposed to trying to you know, turn the whole world upside down, either personally or in our families and our offices, um, which can be disruptive more than uh, providing an innovation or, or sustainable practices. It's all about creating sustainability. And one thing that I would say I've noticed is all those places where I'm not doing that. <laughs> Uh, for instance, um, you know, a plastic water that I picked up, you know, after getting a massage and like, oh, wow, I need to be more prepared and bring my own water container so that I'm not contributing to the plastic waste that's going on, you know, in our world. As a simple example, I'm finding that my access to leading a greener and leaner life is noticing all the places where I'm not doing that. And rather than making myself wrong, just being, oh, okay, wow, I need to be a little bit more prepared when I go out to a restaurant or you know, to the different places where I may very likely want to bring home a container of food or have uh, some water available. We'd love to hear the different things that you've been able to do, whether it's participating in reducing your food waste or reusing items gaining lean efficiencies in your office, in any ways that you've been reducing waste um, as we go and pioneer this uh, together to create a better world inside of our families, inside of our offices, in our communities, and ultimately around the world. Month in May is Small Business Week. And so we'll be talking about all the different ways that celebrate small businesses and how they're the backbone of the economic engine of our world. And, uh, and then what we'll be doing here locally to celebrate Small Business Week. So with that, thank you for participating in whatever way you did in Earth Month. And um, if you enjoyed this video, please like it, share it, and subscribe to our YouTube channel.